guys welcome back to another episode of no man's sky so last episode we worked on exploring a planet we didn't get all the nanites but i did make some changes to the base i hopped on here to refine a bunch of stuff down so we could get rid of our junk items uh, left some of the uh runaway mold um from refining just because it was not an even amount of nanites uh, otherwise so I got 200 nanites from refining all that slime down and I um, think I got a little bit more ferrite but I used some so uh, some changes you might have noticed is the farm is now moved so there's no farming material base building places down here now and the science lab is this way and in here and this direction I expanded to include the um, what do you call it? the uh, other guy the um, geo bay person and if we go upstairs armor is still in the same spot uh, I haven't decorated up here too much but if we go into here, we have the farms. So we have a, a few more farms. I upgraded the base, added a few more, and um, moved some things around. So we have our get knip, some of the um, other things here. We got the frost, crystals, uh, solarium, star bulbs. And I planted a few more mushrooms and we got a few cactuses and that. So what we should be able to craft up is, um, should be able to craft up, let's see here, one of those which requires acid and unstable gel and one circuit board. So that's basically what I was able to get so far um, with what we see here, uh, not including all that stuff over there. So just those three plots and then that, and then these ones along that side. So, uh, we will be exploring another planet today and, um, hopefully we can get all the creatures discovered. Uh, there is a radioactive planet that we'll have to go to. So we'll be checking that out after I harvest and craft up all the products. Now these aren't actually ready, unfortunately. These ones are, they'll probably be ready by the end of the episode. I'm not sure how many hours or minutes. Oh, they're only almost ready. So I'll just wait for that and then we'll go ahead and get started for today. Thank you. 
Alright guys, so this planet's definitely a no-go. It's an extreme planet. It actually turns out to be the most radioactive planet we've been on. So, um, yeah, we're not going to try to even find all the creatures. And even if we could, um, the there's rare underground creatures as well. So we won't be able to um, most likely find any of them. Which is okay. I did claim a crashed starship uh, we were just at that location but um, it's a red and white uh, shuttle so class uh, class a shuttle so we could probably even upgrade that and see if we can't repair it over time and uh, maybe even make it or one of our ships I know they're not that great for combat or anything like that but um you know, it, it's the red and white theme that we're going for, so. Alright, let's see if we can't find another planet. I don't know if that's a moon or what's going on there, so we'll check that out. Might be something that we can explore. Just get a little bit closer. Okay, we haven't been on that one yet. Uh, empty planet. There's probably no creatures there. Rusted metal, magnetized fairy. We can pop down for a quick look, I guess. Uh, I'm not sure. Yeah, we have two more planets left. So that, and then we'll be off to the next system. So we'll probably even be able to um, map this entire system today, probably. So that'll be pretty good. Alright, so we'll go here, we'll check that out, see what it looks like down there. Sometimes there might be some stuff that we can pick up. Empty planet, I think it's more of like a, um, a barren wasteland with a lot of rocks. Usually that's what it is. I'm not sure if that's what it'll be when we go there, but we'll, we'll pop down still and take a quick look. Might be able to find some stuff on it as well, so who knows. But, um, yeah, we'll do that. And then we'll uh, go explore that other planet. Alrighty then. Let's go down here, take a quick look. Whoa, okay, so this is a cold planet, is it? This looks like cold rocks. I usually don't... I haven't come across a planet like this with cold rocks before with uh, icy rock, so that's well, something new. Alright, so we get to explore a new system today. So this one's got, so let's see here, looks to be quite a few different um, uh, planets. So we'll check this one out. It's a Gex system, so we'll head that way. And um, I'm not sure if we're going when our space battle will be but that will 
I think the next one is basically when we um, get our freighter. So whenever that may be. Uh, it doesn't look like it's this time, so. Okay, first contact, which means we're the first ones here. We'll stop in at the station and... Oof. Trying to dodge all these uh, asteroids here. Okay, so we'll stop in here and... Check out what the trades and stuff are as usual and learn some extra language. And... Um, Ooh, this one's a lot different. I like the look of this one. Feels very almost steampunk almost. With the color scheme and the uh, accent of the metal and stuff. Looks really good. Alright, so this is a trading one by the looks of it. Uh, we might be able to go up there and take a look and see what kind of trades they have. See what they got. Okay, so we don't have any rep with these guys at all. Uh, living glass, parakeet. Uh, yeah, we could really use that. The warp hypercore. Hmm. Salvage data. Teleport coordinates. I think the only thing that we can really actually donate here is the uh, salvage data. We don't have any on us at the moment, but we might be able to find some later on. Alright, so let's uh, quickly take a look at what they have for the um, exocrafts and the uh, starships and other trades. And then we'll um, start working our way back to a planet, I guess. Purchase modules. Let's see what they got. Okay, they got some Class A ones. Uh, Exocraft mining laser and Exocraft cannon. You have. Alright guys, so I've been just repairing uh, some of the ships that we found. Uh, we got a few of them. This one's kind of big. Park it over there, I guess. We'll have to like go over there to repair it, but 
Uh, this one we found not too long ago. Actually not that bad looking ship. Uh, I'm not sure what the stats are. I can't remember. I think it's class. Oh, it's class A. Um, let's see here. We'll repair that. And we'll repair. Okay, the thrusters are already good. Uh, what's this? Pulse engine efficiency, automatic load charging, maneuverability. I don't know if I want to keep this one, honestly. Though we can take that. And. I don't think there's really anything else I want from this. Might be able to break that down into some components. No, we can't. Okay, so let's. Something that we can't really break down, but um, yeah, it should be good to go for uh, transportation. Um, just double check the um, make sure the yeah, that's those are all good to go. Okay, so this is the um, that shuttle that we found today, and that's that um, hauler that we found yesterday, and I think we found that one yesterday, or one of those two are from yesterday. This one's from today, and I was going to put in that uh, that thing so we get a little bit more shield protection, and we can just dismantle that actually, put that in our inventory, and uh, yeah, so next episode what we'll do is we'll scrap down th those other two ships, and then we'll be able to... Um, start repairing this one and work on that a little bit but outside of that if you are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe comment down below rate the video and i will see you guys next time thanks for watching peace out